six, and these are really good games, and I uh, I like them both. It's Leipzig versus Union. Remember, they met in midweek in the semi final of the cup. You know, Leipzig at minus two ten, but my league's my Leipzig minus one is minus one thirty. But Union Berlin, who have been going great guns, won three in their last five, plus one. So basically, they can lose by one. And that's a push. And B still at plus money. Plus 110. But Berlin to go to Leipzig is plus 625. The under overs two and a half, which I thought was generous. I thought we see three goals here. Minus 125 for the over two and a half. But the draw is at plus 350. Um, Kev, Leipzig win this game. Uni on Berlin maybe cause them a few problems. Both teams to score an over. Yeah, possibly. Uh, I did the game on Wednesday between Leipzig and Union. And Union played really well. And I think they were really unfortunate to lose, especially in the way that they did. They made it ever so hard for Leipzig in that first half. Um, Leipzig really struggled to open them up. And what was notable was how much space Union had on the counter. Geraldo Becker and Taiwo Awoni caused them all manner of problems. Should have made it 2-0. Becker went through and then he tried to play it to the far post for Awoni and he just got the angle of the pass wrong. And actually, at that stage, if Union had gone one had gone two nil up, I don't think you could have argued really. They'd controlled the game in the way that they can, in the sense that they don't give much away, and then they're really dangerous on the counter. Leipzig were a bit pedestrian. Eventually, got back in the game with Nkunku uh, going down. It was a clumsy challenge by Pauli Akel, and they got the penalty. And yes, they built pressure towards the end. And yes, Forsberg scored right at the end of the game to win two one. But it wasn't great from Leipzig. And you've got a Leipzig team that's playing loads of games right now. They've got Rangers at the weekend, uh, uh, Rangers on Thursday yeah. in the semi final of the Europa League. And Union will give you nothing. They'll, they'll rotate a little bit, but not loads. I imagine the fullback positions will change, but I can't see much else changing. Grisha Permel's been playing really well. So I think rinse and repeat from Wednesday. I, I imagine Union will make it tough. Uh, and try and hit on the counter again. So I wouldn't necessarily put off anybody going for plus one for Union at, what was it, plus 110, I think you said? Um, yeah. I, that, for me, if I had to go for a bet from this game, that'd be the way I'd go. Were they both at full strength in midweek? I mean, because yeah. but basically we've got Union yeah. Berlin and now coming. Union Berlin for a blind man is very strong, very organised with a ton of self-belief. Then they lost their way. For a while, and it was almost like they were disjointed. But now it almost like they've come back again, especially with what happened in the uh, Berlin derby. But they were already showing shoots of coming back to that DNA. Now, Leipzig, they're uh, they cannot give up or they cannot take their eye off the ball because yes, they've got the semi-final in the Europa League against Rangers. Remember that's over two legs, but. They have got Freiburg and they've got Leverkusen chasing them down as well. So it's inconceivable to think that Leipzig are not going to win this game because this is, you've got to win your home games. Otherwise, you look in the mirror and go, we've only got ourselves to blame, Alex. Imagine to be in uh, <clears throat> Max Cruz's shoes uh, right now with uh, Wolfsburg uh, fight. Let, OK, not fighting to avoid relegation and Union Berlin fighting for the European uh, competitions. Imagine to be Max Kruse right now. But uh, Imagine like, counting his cash, Alex. Uh, how much more to be? A lot more. A, A lot, lot more? more. Okay. Yeah. Not as, as much they... as you, though, Alex. Uh, yeah, no, I'm signing with Adidas, uh, with, uh, with care for the next season. This is the way we are dressed uh, all Adidas today. Um, RB Leipzig, 17 matches unbeaten, 13 wins in the process in these 17 matches across all competitions. Absolutely unreal. And uh, consistency is the key. And uh, uh, wins are bringing wins. I know that uh, Union are very organized. Uh, they are uh, full of confidence, even though uh, they, they lost uh, uh, in the cup game, but uh, they are coming uh, on the back of three uh, wins uh, in a row in, uh, in the league. And they kept two clean sheets in the process. An important win uh, uh, last weekend uh, uh, against uh, um, Eintracht Frankfurt. Uh, I think that this match will be cagier than expected. I think that uh, Tedesco might uh, rest some of the players, not a lot, like one, two of them. 
I wonder how many, how much energy this Nkunku has uh, till the end of the season because he's playing week in and week out and he's playing midweek weekend, mid midweek weekend. And in a week where he didn't have the European commitments, he played the cup, you know, absolutely impressive uh, where he will uh, uh, land. But um, everybody at uh, Leipzig, uh, starting with the uh, uh, chief of the board, uh, declared that um, they want to keep uh, most of the team. And Nkunku is one of the uh, players that they will have him there 1000%. So they might improve his contract and play in the Champions League and do a better job next season because after uh, replacing uh, Jesse Marsh, they are another team. Look a uh, difference from a uh, from, uh, uh, manager to another. But yeah, I don't know. Draw at half time. I'm staying away a little bit from this game. We might see the under flash. I, I don't want to go against you. This is why I stayed away because I know that you are on the over. Yeah. And I will cheer for the over. But this is a tricky game. And I, I like that I see that Berlin plus scoring one. at minus 135. Uh, yeah, I like that plus one uh, of uh, Kev at uh, plus 110. But I wouldn't go against RB Leipzig at how they are right now, right? So oh. you cannot fade them. No, but the reason I went with the over is because Leipzig have got the uh, the audacity and the talent. And, and, and they're on a roll. Listen, they, I'd say they're probably the, one of the strongest sides in Europe when they get their front foot going. Now, the cup game was maybe a mere distraction. But I've gone with the over rather than the both teams to score an over because I just see that Leipzig could score free on their own. So, again, it was one of those. But minus 135 for the away side. But for me, it's over two and a half. Minus 125. Good game. Could be a trap. Uh, again, I didn't really want to go with the money line. I know that Ashley's gone with, uh, or suggesting maybe, Leipzig win and both teams to score at plus 270. Um, correct, correct score group. Leipzig 1-0, 2-0, 2. Well, let's hope the 2-1 comes in because I've gone with the over. 